You'll have to excuse me for coming in like this. What? I, I don't know at this point. Let's just talk about it first because it's going to get on it, my nerves and everybody else's nerves. Um, the Cowboys played like trash against the Patriots. Conservative play calling doomed this team from the start. Only put up nine points. Had the opportunity to win the game. Yeah, sure, there was some fancy tripping calls. We did not execute. And the Patriots, they did just what they needed to do. They ran the ball away. They ran the ball good enough to where you know, Brady didn't have to do much. Once again, we lose to the Patriots. Sad, sad day. Six and five. But we still somehow lead in the NFC East. But I don't know how long that lead is going to last, considering that the Eagles' schedule is a lot easier than ours coming up. But we do play them one more time. So um, the Texans beat the Colts. You know, it is what it is. It was Thursday night. Uh, the Browns just beat the dog shit out of the Dolphins. Lions lose to the Redskins. You know, Lions just don't have any luck. Jets blow out the Raiders. Now, that was pretty surprising. Sam Darnold that the Jets are just peaking at the right time. Why now? I have no idea. Uh, the Bears beat the Giants. Of course, the Giants are trash. It doesn't really matter whatsoever. Um, Saints beat the Panthers. It was really not that close at first, but then the Panthers just stormed back. And then, you know, at the very end, the Saints did what they needed to do to get the victory. Seahawks, it really wasn't even close. Um, they beat the Eagles 17-9. It really didn't feel like that at all. Um, Eagles played like trash. So many turnovers. Who is going to win the NFC East? Is it going to be the Cowboys or is it going to be the Eagles? I don't know which of I don't know which of these two teams are worse right now, but it's looking pretty bad right now. The Bucks beat the Falcons. It was a quite surprising considering the Falcons had, you know, a lot of momentum. They've been winning games easily the last couple of weeks, and then they just they just shit the bed against the Falcons against the Buccaneers. So you know it is what it is. Uh, Bills. Kind of still don't have an offense, to be completely honest, but they take care of the Broncos 20-3. to Bengals are still winless, so, you know, Duck Hodge is, is going to be the starter for the Steelers for now. Um, you know, um, Steelers win 16-10. You know, it is what it is. Jags beat the t- Jags lose to the Titans. And Derrick Henry, man. What can I tell you about that guy? That guy can run the ball. He is definitely an underrated running back for sure. And the Titans are doing just what they need to do at the right time. They are still in the playoff race themselves. And then lastly, a couple of blowouts to end. Um, Unfortunately, I didn't really see much of the 49ers game, and I'm glad I didn't. I was watching um, Survivor Series. Uh, Of course, you know, WWE has their big four events each and every year. And... You know, you know, all the you know pay per views every month and stuff like that. But this is the WWE um, Survivor Series, one of their big events, and um, Survivor Series was interesting. The Packers 49ers was not. George Kittle ran all over the 49 the Packers defense. Excuse me, and Aaron Rodgers just couldn't get anything going. And the same thing happened in the Ravens Rams. Lamar Jackson just ran all over. Marks Peters got a pick, you know, and I mean, Jerry Goff just looked like trash, you know. It just is what it is. Not a lot to say. Not really. Um, you know, everything lined up well, and everything went well, especially, you know, for ratings and stuff. But, yeah, it's going to pretty much do it. Um, not a lot to say for week number 12. It is what it is, you know. Not a lot happened, to be completely honest. It really just affirms the point that, hey, the 49ers are a force to be reckoned with. The Patriots is still a force to be reckoned with, especially that defense and the Ravens. The Ravens may have an MVP candidate winner, maybe, too, on their hands. So, yeah, that'll do it.